What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Cops do side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. I got another channel message in, so I'm going to um, share it. I hope everybody's doing well. Thanks, everybody, for all the new subscribers. Um, you guys are just the best. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart. Just to let you know. Single mom with two kids, that really helps. Okay, so the channel message I received was free general collective reading, so it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. So... The channel message I received was the death of a um, feminine cancer is about to become very, very significant in a healthcare setting very soon. The police is about to question several ex coworkers of this feminine cancer um, about her about her death. Um, is what I heard. I heard um, uh, also it was like forty five seconds to a minute after that. I heard um, police are about to get wind about her having connections with co-workers outside of work and it's going to prompt the police to question the co-workers the co-workers are going to be very um going to be shocked and very nervous about the questioning so you plug it in however it resonates that is so strong so healthcare worker energy um uh, how that resonates um a lot of workplace energy in here recently a lot so you plug it in how it resonates, but it's a death of a femme cancer. So whoever this is, it's a femme cancer that's already passed away. Oh my goodness. It's a, so whoever this feminine cancer is, she's already passed away. Um, like death angel, like she's already on the other side, whoever she is. Um, she could have cancer in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, mid, hammer, Jupiter charts, but she's already passed away. Um, but I heard the police are about to get wind that she hung out with co-workers outside of work. Um, somehow the co-workers are significant or they think, or maybe the police might think the co-workers are significant in her death. Sounds like her death has not been solved. Like it's some kind of unsolved mystery or something of that nature is what it's sounding like here. Um, but it's, it sounds like the police are about to have reasonable suspicion to question the co-workers um because they're about to find out they either just have found out or they're about to find out that she had connections with these co-workers outside of work so i heard the police are going to come question the co-workers i heard the co-workers will be very nervous and shocked that the police are going to be up there questioning them um, it's going to lead to many series of chain of events someone is going to reveal information on this that others do not want revealed but it will be revealed it's going to lead to other series of chain of events oh my lord you plug it in how it resonates and i shuffled and we have imprisonment on the bottom of the deck man this is strong so i think the co-workers might have had something to do with the cancer's death the feminine cancer's death possibly um, because I heard someone in this workplace situation is going to reveal to the police something that the other co-workers don't want the police to know, and it's going to lead, create other series of shame events. And then we have imprisonment on the bottom of the deck. So I think somebody might go to jail. I think somebody might go to jail over the cancer, uh, death of this feminine cancer. Um, it's a femme cancer. She's already passed away. She could have cancer in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or thumb, and hammer, Jupiter charts, RIP cancer, ma'am, whoever you are in the spiritual realm. Um, but somehow she has hung out with her co-workers outside of work and it's some kind of unsolved case or mystery to her death. Somehow the police are about to either have already learned or about to learn that she had connections with co-workers inside of work. It sounds like these police are about to come into the workplace because, um, and I say that from the spiritual download because I heard, come on baby, you can come over. Because I heard, um, someone in the workplace situation is about to reveal something the other co-workers don't want revealed. So I'm thinking the police might physically go up to the workplace or they might call and speak to somebody in this workplace and it lead to connections inside and they speak to somebody that the other co-workers don't want to speak to. So I don't know if they physically come up to the work. Well, I heard they're going to be nervous. I heard they're going to be nervous. So, well, that could be a phone call too. 
Um, but probably, I'm thinking probably more in person because if they're really nervous about it, the police officers will, police officers will be able to see the nervousness, the nonverbal nervousness more easily in person than they can on in a phone conversation. Um, but, you know, everybody's on different time of life paths. It's really all in how these officers handle it them out their own selves. But if I was the officer, I would go in person. That way I could really, really see the nonverbal expressions, the nervous, nonverbal nervousness, um, because they can cover it up in a phone conversation. You know what I'm saying? More easily than they can in person with the nonverbal nervousness. Um, but, you know, that's just me. I'm not a police officer, but that's how I would handle it if I was an officer. Um, maybe you're an officer about to do this, um, but you're about to contact somebody in this workplace situation where you're about to phone call, use a phone call method, an email method, or a text message, text method. Um, I would assume probably God, not a text method, or a, hopefully not an email method. Hopefully it's either a phone call or in person. I think the in-person, if I was a police officer, would be more appropriate to get the nonverbal, but I'm not an officer. Um, but anyways, I heard it's going to lead to other series of chain events. It's going to lead to other series of chain events. Um, and we have imprisonment on the bottom deck. Just saying. Number 29 could be a very significant number. It could be a possible age of viewers, somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible jersey number, possible green card number, um, etc. Number 29. There will be a crack in the case. And this feminine cancer, one of her former co-workers is very significant in her death. Oh my God. Whoa. Oh my God. Okay, hold on. Let me see if I hear anything else. As are others. Arrest will be coming. Oh, God. Oh, my God. You plug it in, how it resonates. Oh, my God. Somebody's co-worker had a hand in help helping their death in some shape, form, or fashion. Some it is drug-related. Some it is drug-related, I heard. Oh, my God. Whoa. Okay. Oof. Some it is not, but definitely covering it up, but it will be revealed. Okay, so it's at least two camp fem cancers in the universe. You have to plug it in how it resonates. Uh, there's millions and billions of people in the world, so you have to plug it in how it resonates. But it's a feminine cancer that has already passed on. Some of these feminine cancers, the co-workers had hands in their death in some shape, form, or fashion. Some it's drug-related. So... These co-workers might have given this cancer drugs, or um, that's what I'm thinking. They probably gave them drugs or gave them connections to someone with drugs. For some of these, can uh, for some of the fem cancers, it's at least two fem cancers in the universe. At least one of them, it is not drug related, but the co-workers are covering up what really happened so they don't be, so probably so they're not connected in her death. Um, they don't want to go. They don't want to go to prison, basically. Oh, but I heard it's about to it's about to come out whether they want it to or not. Oh my God. Whoa. I was supposed to be in bed. Oh my God. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't hear anything else. Oh, my God. But I heard arrests were coming. Arrests were coming. And it's something to do with her former co-workers. She's passed. Uh, there's at least two fem cancers in the universe. One, it's drug-related. One, it's not. But the other one where it's not drug-related, the co-workers know what happened or know details of similar of what happened, I guess. But they're covering it up because they don't want to. I think they don't want to be an accessory to the crime or they actually did help her pass away in some shape, form, or fashion. Or they just know what happened and they don't want to be an accessory. Holy shit, a moly, man. This is strong as hell. Oh, 
plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. Oh my God. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't. Maybe you're the police that's about to um, go question these coworkers. Um, I don't know. I'm pulling this in for a reason. So you might be the coworkers that are about to be questioned. Um, if you just recently had a feminine cancer coworker pass away, I mean, I don't know. You have to plug in your life how it resonates if it resonates for you. And you hung out with this feminine cancer outside of work. I don't know. You have to plug your story in how it resonates. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So I feel like I could be pulling in the people, the coworkers that used to hang out with this femme cancer outside of work, or I could be pulling in the police, um, or maybe the family of the femme cancers. One of these femme cancers, it's drug related. So I'm thinking the coworkers either offered them drugs, or well, gave them drugs, gave them drugs, gave her drugs, and she took them, and I mean, she passed away, or gave her connections to somebody street side for drugs and she went and bought some drugs and she passed away but for some of these can uh one of the cancers it's not drug related but somehow the death is connected to the co-workers so they know something about details about the death either they did something to her or they know something about details of how she passed away but they're covering the shit up but either way, it's about to come out. It's about to come out through somebody in this workplace, it sounds like, that doesn't want it to come out. I think about the connections of them hanging out with her outside of work because it sounds like they're trying to cover that up. Uh, but they're trying to cover it up for strategic reasons because they do not want to go to jail, is what it sounds like, or prison. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, my God, this is so strong. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, I'm going to die of this. Okay. I love you guys so much. Namaste.